Hey everybody, it's Clue the Dragon here. Um, today is the first official video I'm going to be doing on the series called Advice from Mama Dirk, which is me. Well, more so actually just the nickname that everybody tends to call me. Um, honestly, I think it has something to do with the fact that I kind of have like a motherly personality towards my friends. Um, but I figured, you know, this is going to be a series that's going to continue and it's going to talk about like advice that I can give my fans, I can give my friends and basically, you know, anybody who needs it because I mean, honestly, we all need a little bit of advice from time to time and sometimes we go and, um, you know, we go through hard times or things that we just don't know what to do. It, sorry, my cat's sneezing in the background, but bless you, kitty. Um, I figured I could use my wisdom and share it with the furry community and hopefully use a positive impact and help somebody in need. So, today actually is going to be a little bit unique and I'm going to do a multi-series upload and multi-video upload. So, there's going to be more videos I'm going to do today. I'm sorry if I sound like I'm out of breath. I'm still working on the ventilation system in my suit head. So, from time to time, I do need to take a deep breath and just, you know, oxygen, because it's good for you. <laughs> so, today's video is going to be advice for the new furries in the fandom, also the younger furries in the fandom. So, shouts out to you. I love you. You're awesome. Welcome to the fandom. And if you've been here for a while, I'm glad you could join me today on this night and listen to what I have to say. So what we're going to be talking about today, advice-wise, is a couple of things. And they're going to lead from one thing to another. And this is just because I've been in the fandom for over, I believe, 10 years now. So I've developed a little bit of knowledge about things that I could really talk about and go over with people. And maybe, you know, hopefully help somebody who might need it. And prevent bad things from happening that I wish I would have learned when I joined the fandom. Number one. Be proud of yourself. Nothing more important than that. You need to be proud of yourself, who you are, and love yourself. Unfortunately, furries get a bad reputation with some people, but you can't let that bring you down at all. You are you. You are meant to be here. You are welcome to be here, and we love you very, very, very much. Be proud of who you are, and don't listen to the haters, because honestly, it's like an opinion. Everybody's got an opinion, right? But it doesn't affect you. It doesn't affect who you are. It doesn't affect who you are as a person. It doesn't affect, like, you know, your character or whatever. It's just somebody's opinion. It's like a cheap, nasty hamburger. Everybody can have one, but it's better not to digest. Second thing I want to talk about today is going to be take some time to think about the designing nature of your Sona. For example, my Sona is a celestial guardian dragon. I've taken many, many years to design this Sona. Please take the time to really think about who you are as a person regarding to my number one topic I talked about today. And think about like your personality. Think about, you know, what are your favorite colors? What are some things that you like to do? If you were an animal, what could you be? Obviously, right? Because you're making a persona, duh. You know, but really take the time. Take, because, you know, honestly, you're going to have that Sona for a while. And personas are like a bag of chips. You can't have just one. I have many. <laughs> this is just my main Sona, which is basically the one that everybody gets to know me by. So I suggest really taking the time to create your main Sona. There's a lot of lovely YouTubers who have made a video or two on like helping create your Sonas. You can even hire an artist to help many different options entirely. So, take some time to create your Sona. For example, like I said, mine's a Celestial Guardian Dragon. I made my own species and I'm related to the medical field. I'm related to pediatrics and children and I just love dragons. That's who I decided to be. Third thing I want to talk about today, this is very, very important for all furries in general. Not just the new ones, not just the young ones, whatever. Please, for the love of everything holy, avoid drama the best that you can. Please, I'll say it again. Avoid drama the best that you can. It's really a waste of your time. It's just like dealing with, like, 
negative opinions of people who have nothing better to do but sit on the internet and be completely negative and hate on people who are trying to make a name for themselves or trying to be a better person. Avoid it. Avoid it on Facebook. Avoid it on Twitter. <laughs> Avoid it on Twitter. Avoid it on TikTok. Avoid it on Furry, Fur Affinity, whatever social media platform because unfortunately that tends to be the cause of a lot of depression and self-doubt. A lot of negative things can spawn from that. I've been there. I know. Avoid it at all costs. The other thing I want to talk about is make connections with people. Learn who you are as a person. I know some of you might be scared. You might be nervous. You might be an introvert, but that's okay. I've made so many connections through my mate and his friends have become my friends. I've become friends with lovely people who I always looked up to, who I always were a fan of. And, you know, I honestly did it just by being a kind person, just by being funny and nice. And they saw that in me. Make connections with people, go to parties, go to dances, because furry conventions are honestly a lot more fun when you have friends to enjoy them with. Last thing I want to talk about today is be your own light in the fandom. What do I mean by that? I mean simply this. Be your own light. Find who you are as a person and let that shine. Because honestly, that's going to bring more people to you. Not all about fame. Not all about popularity. It's about who you are, enjoying yourself, expressing yourself, and loving yourself. Be your own light because nobody else can be that special light that you have within you. And it is a gift. So please share it with everybody because we would love to see it. That's all I have for now. If you like this video, please hit like. I won't pressure you to subscribe, but if you want to see more videos, feel free to subscribe. I'm done with my subscribe and like speech, I promise you. But if you like this, please let me know. I'll continue to upload. Until then, I hope you all have a very blessed day or night and be your own light. Make your whole world shine. Alrighty. Bye, Dergs and Furs.